how do you know someone's heart is shut towards you the volume goes up and the ears shut down maybe in the beginning they'll get even more angry when you do this but you know what it's fine the only thing is you cannot choose to respond to wrong because to respond to wrong you have to become wrong you know what we are doing we are speaking to them exactly how they are speaking to us but expecting different results how to deal with husband's aggression and aggression in kids and how to inculcate good values in kids and how to make the home very peaceful and a harmonious home you know what i don't think it's a one day thing it's a journey you have to go on you know it's a journey that you have to go on where you have to start to respond better when people speak better and stay away from conversations when the things are not going your way so you have to start to look at in your life ke whenever they speak badly like for example if my son is not talking to me the right way i will tell him sweetheart whenever you can talk to me the right way come back and speak to me i want to sit down and understand what you're trying to say but as you speak in this tonality or with these choice of words andar hi nahi ja raha kuch so you know what i'm not going to be able to understand so i'm going to let the storm pass let him shout scream whatever and let him go i'm not going to put fuel to the fire i'm going to either add water or nothing at some point the storm has to pass once it's passed then i don't mind sitting down and asking them you know what in our family we have started to speak very rudely to one another or in a very aggressive way to one another what can we do to not make that happen you know how can we operate with one another whenever somebody starts to get angry what is the right way to approach them so in our house nobody speaks to nobody in that manner so if so if i if i start shouting punit will just say you know what whenever you're calmer let's talk i talk it out because i want to be intelligent about it but when you speak like this i can't receive you i do the same to my kids and maybe in the beginning they'll get even more angry when you do this but you know what it's fine the only thing is you cannot choose to respond to wrong because to respond to wrong you have to become wrong and if you become wrong if somebody is shouting and you're shouting back Guess what? Why are you shouting? Because both the hearts have closed. How do you know someone's heart is shut towards you? The volume goes up and the ears shut down. The louder someone speaks, you should know their ears and heart have shut down. That's the that's why they are feeling the need to scream on top of their voices because theirs is shut down. They are thinking yours is also shut down, so you can't hear them. So they get louder and louder. When someone's heart and ears are shut towards you, do you want get do you want to get louder? or do you want to retreat my suggestion is retreat the louder someone speaks to you that's the time for you to retreat not to get louder right and then when you retreat and you let the storm pass in whichever manner it passes when that person comes back to you now in a calm demeanor you can have a better conversation okay what we do is we decide to at that point teach them the lesson don't talk to me like this how dare you speak to me like this you know what we are doing we are speaking to them exactly how they are speaking to us but expecting different results nahi hoga na